What's up guys, Milton Muggy here and welcome to episode 21 of my squad builder series. Uh, this week I actually got the episode number right because I went and checked before I did this video. Uh, so I made sure that was cool before I uh, started it. For this team today I have got a sweet little hybrid again uh, for you guys because I know you guys seem to uh, like the hybrids more than any other uh, squads. Uh, just quickly before I start and get into the team, I just wanted to say that I have now put all the squads builders I've done into a playlist so you guys can go and look through my squads uh, from FIFA 12 because I know we're coming to the end of FIFA now. So you can go and check back at some of the squads I've had and maybe make a decision on what squad you're going to end FIFA 12 with. And uh, if you're looking for a few ideas, there may be some in there. But yeah, this squad was a hybrid I just designed on Foothead and uh, I tried to make it around one of the players, which is the left centre mid. I'll get into him when I get there. Um, but... Yeah, it's actually uh, quite a nice hybrid. It's got a few uh, different nations. Uh, I mean, it's got everything. It's got uh, golden forms, and uh, it just looks sweet. So, first we're going to Kawashima in gold, the blue card from uh, Lies SK for the Pro League. He is <laughs> a poor goalkeeper. I am really sorry to say this, because the first game he did for me, he was absolutely amazing. Then the second game, he was a little bit poor. Third game he was good, and then he just dropped off from there, and he ended up being just a really bad keeper for me. And uh, it's disappointing because this would have been a really great team if he turned out to be a really good goalkeeper. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, uh, he does a job. He does do the job, nonetheless. Um, so he can he can complain, but he's okay. Right back we have Oper. I believe it's pronounced maybe Opara. Meh, whatever. Uh, 2,000 coins he cost me. Oh, sorry, I just go back to Kawashima. He cost me 23,000 coins. Yeah, but Oper cost me 2,000 coins and is from uh, the Belgian Pro League also, from Standard Liège. Cost me 2,000 coins. Very good right back. Solid at the back. Uh, 90 pace. He's very good. Now, the two centre-backs I've got were a little bit of surprise packages for me. I tried to go for uh, some centre-backs that I hadn't seen used before. The first one was uh, Zaidi from Liège, the same team as... Um, Kawashima, his informed silver version, and uh, he's pretty decent. There's nothing really wrong with him. He scored some really nice goals for me, to be honest. His shooting is actually pretty good. His uh, right foot is actually very, very good. 12,750 coins for a defender, 70 pace, 75 defending, 73 heading, and a silver. You can't really go wrong with him, if I'm perfectly honest. I do really enjoy playing with him. The left centre back was one that I really found a, a huge surprise. 15,000 coins, uh, Abdenor. Yeah, from Toulouse, I believe it is, yeah. Um, 76 pace and 83 defending, 77. He's really, really good. He's quick, he's strong, he's good in the air. He, he really is a very good defender. And uh, if you're looking for some uh, League One defenders, that's the French League One, then i definitely get this guy because uh, he's really good. Now, the left back is also from Toulouse, Mbengue. 84 pace and it cost me 1,000 coins. Just w sort of one of those players that fills in at left back. Uh, but he's actually very good. 84 pace is obviously quick enough. And he's actually very good at defending as far as left backs go. Uh, I do actually quite like him a lot. Now the first of the centre mids we have the right centre mid is Wakaso. This guy is an animal. If you've not tried him yet, please go and try him. I bought him for 4,000 coins and he is from Villarreal. He gets the link with uh, Rossi there. But if I quickly nip onto the internet, I can just read some of his stats out uh, for you. His physical stats are absolutely amazing. He scores some great long shots. And he just seems to be an all-round great player. One of my favourite silvers on the game now. I'm just getting the uh, stats for him up now. Can I spell his name right? No, I can't. Yeah, I'll have to get them uh, up a little bit later. But you can go search it on uh, Foothead and uh, have a look at his physical stats. Because they are all in the 80s. Every single one of them. His pace and strength is just unbelievable. Now we have Giuseppe Rossi in centre mid. And this guy is... Also, it's, play, it's actually a surprise. Usually play him at striker. He's his default position, I think, or centre forward. I decided to play him in centre mid because I knew his shot was very good. And his all-round stats were pretty decent. And he's got 83 pace, 83 shooting. And his shooting is a complete lie. He can shoot from anywhere and it'll just... It'll be on target, definitely, if it's not in the back of the net. He's really, really good. Left centre mid. This is the player I wanted to build a team around. He's recently transferred to PSG. He's a wonder kid from uh, Syria Bay. Uh, yeah, I'm going to say Syria B. I'm guessing <laughs> that the like, Italian letter for B. I'm going to say Syria B, but yeah. 17,000 coins. It's actually relatively expensive uh, because he's recently transferred. And uh, he's got four star skills, five star weak foot. And um, he's yet to score for me, but he's very been very solid. He's not done much wrong, if I'm perfectly honest. 17,000, meh. 
A bit debatable on his performances, but he's been good enough. Centre forward, the first of the attacking players is Barini, his transferred Liverpool version. This guy's been a monster for me, it seems. 43,500 coins he cost me, and uh, he's been great in great scoring goals. He's, he's, his follies are really good. Uh, he, they, they don't show in his in-game stats, but his volleys just seem to be absolutely outstanding. Uh, his finishing's 90, which is very good also. And uh, he just seems to be there when you need that extra man to slot it in the back of the net. And uh, the main thing about him is the assists. He seems to get a, a, a huge amount of this. I can't like say how many. He, he feeds the front two so well. Uh, it just seems like he's just very good uh, at passing the ball, even though he's only got 54 passes. And uh, I definitely recommend you try him out. 43,000 is a little bit expensive. Let him come down a bit and he will uh, drop to a nice price that is worth it. First of the strikers, Mario Balotelli, his purple man of the match card, international man of the match. 79 games played, it says 73 goals. He hasn't played that many games for me. He's played about 12 and he scored a bucket load. He's a really good striker for me. A lot of people I know have tried him out and uh, complained about him. Perfectly honest, but I really like him if you play with him in the right way. If you feed him, he will score. But if you're looking for a player that's just going to run through the defence and score, he's not the guy. Uh, he'll finish it well. He's quick, he's strong, and he's good in the air. I do actually like him a lot. And my favourite player in this team is 88 Luis Suarez. I was surprised at his price. 130,000. I just mentioned that Balotelli was uh, about 130 as well. I lent him to uh, someone just to try him out. But yeah, Suarez, absolutely outstanding. He is really, really quick. He is really, really strong. He's got 92 strength, I think it is, in-game. And his shooting is awesome. His heading is really good. He's one of my favourite players on the game now. I've tried him out. His 87 was amazing. This one's even better. His dribbling also is just uncomprehendable. He's very, very good. So that's his team. Uh, I believe it's got four leagues. Three leagues, four leagues. I don't know. Uh, I'll just quickly count them up. It's got three leagues, yeah. So it's a three-league hybrid, but it's got quite a few nations. It's got one, two, uh, one, four, three... Four, five, six, six uh, nations, which is uh, pretty good. So it's a pretty nice hybrid, and uh, I'll add this into the playlist, and you can go look at all the squads. So thank you for watching, guys, and I I'll see you later.